Flagstaff is known as a green community. However, some would like to make it even greener with laws to control the use of plastic bags in stores. Reporter Matias Tatumez tells us what it would what it would take to bring a plastic bag ordinance to Flagstaff. Flagstaff City Council is open to considering a ban on plastic bags, and while there are no clear details yet on what this might include, there are plenty of opinions on what the ban could mean for Flagstaff. While there are potential benefits, Flagstaff Mayor Jerry Neighbors cautions that there is still a lot of ambiguity concerning the scope of the ban. I think there are a lot of questions about this, and we need uh, information from uh, various sources. What do the stores think about this? What impact will it have on the stores exactly? Are we talking about an absolute ban or are we talking about a discouraging fee of 10 cents or 15 cents per bag? Even though there are concerns about the potential ban, George Yaskovich, owner of the Flagstaff Farmers Market, has already moved forward with plans to phase out plastic bags at his store. We got a hold of some recycling bins. Uh, we started offering recycling of plastic here at the store. We went out of our regular bags into a recycled, heavier duty plastic bag. And then when those were gone, we had paper bags. We're utilizing a lot of our smaller cardboard boxes for larger orders. Regardless of the details of the ban, Council Member Eva Putsova warns that the heavy use of plastic bags does come with a price. Uh, a lot of people think of uh, plastic bags as something that we get uh, in a grocery store for free. But there is cost associated with uh, plastic bags. Um, Flagstaff Sustainability Commission um, assess the cost to the community at $150,000 annually. A lot of communities, uh, entire states have done that. Um, and I think it's something very sensible uh, to do. For NAZ Today, this is Matias Tautimez.